Hi, welcome to Cycling Vancouver. My name is Steve and this is Ride 117. Today is Wednesday, June 30th, 2021. We have had 37 degrees Celsius temperatures for the last couple days and though our heat wave is finally starting to subside, it is still hot on the west coast. The town of Lytton in British Columbia's Fraser Valley hit 42 degrees Celsius yesterday. Later today, it would be destroyed by fire. The residents were given 15 minutes notice to evacuate. I decided to wake around sunrise and get out riding early and avoid the heat. Given the unusually high number of heat related deaths in BC over the last few days, that was probably a wise decision. Of course, for a night person like me, I normally only see sunrise when I'm going to bed. I crashed around 2 a.m. and I managed to wake around 4.40. Of course, I tried to convince myself I was better off sleeping and that I should go riding tomorrow morning. I finally got up and that was it. Coffee, breakfast, and sat down to watch the beginning of stage five of the Tour de France. I finally forced myself out the door at 6.30. It was really nice and cool at this time of the morning. The temperature was around 19 Celsius, though it was expected to get back up to the low 30s again. There was a strong breeze out of the east, which is unusual, but it sure felt great. We must have had quite the windstorm last night. I was off to West Vancouver to climb back into the British properties. I figured I would ride Erie Mount Drive and possibly some of Cypress Mountain.
I was carrying way too much speed into that corner, but when I tried to brake, the wheels started sliding and I quickly ended up over the sidewalk. Thankfully, I still made the corner, but I lost a lot of style points for that. That driver gave me a bit of a look. After a nice break, I decided to ride up to the picnic area.
Oh, I thought you had a lemonade stand. Oh, that'd be nice. I really did wish he had a lemonade stand. When there is no wind, I love this descent. I just get into an aero tuck and go. And there is no need to hit the brakes until it's time to turn.
It's time to head home and enjoy the descent through Stanley Park.